attention to Goku, baby! In this tutorial, I'll show you how to trade in Pokemon games, but this is only for Game Boy and Game Boy Color. Alright, so go to emulatorzone.com. Descriptions will be the below. Uh, then you go to Game Boy. Let's go on to TGB, because it's the only one that supports uh, trade. So download it. I already have it, so I'm not going to download it again. Then you're going to go to Cool ROM. If you don't already don't have, if, if you already have the games, you can skip this step. But if you don't, go to Game Boy Color and choose the games you want to download. And then download them. Alright, well, first you're going to take the ROMs and you're going to put them in the media folder. Now there's a media and save folder. So just drag them into the media folder. So yeah, drag them. And then open up the emulator you usually use. I use Visual Boy Advance. Sorry about that. Uh, so yeah, once that loads, be careful not to speed up the save process. Just saying. Anyways, open that. Then you're gonna save. Go down save. And then what you're gonna do is go to export battery file. And you're going to export it in the save file that came with TGB. Yeah, ignore that. Hold on. Uh, so yeah, just save it in there. And then you're going to open up the other game you want to trade with. Mine just happens to be gold. Or it doesn't really have to be gold. Um, so yeah, open that. Since I already saved because I haven't used it since the last time I traded, uh, you're going to export that as well. Uh, uh, yeah, okay. Um, save it in the save file yet again. Now, what you're going to do is go to save. Now, hold on, let me delete this. Now, you're going to have to name one of the file extensions, or you have to rename it to SA2 because it's looking, the emulator is looking for two files. Doesn't matter which one. Anyways, okay. So GB1 will be the one with the file extension .sav. Mine just happens to be Crystal, so I'm gonna open up Crystal, and then GB2 will be the file extension .sa2. Now keep in mind you're controlling two games at once, so I really suggest or recommend that you save in the Pokemon Center because it'll make your life a lot easier. So. Yeah, go through this process. For some reason it's set up. I don't know why. So yeah, just choose the Pokemon you want to trade and I'll trade. And obviously you're going to save after you trade. Save. And then 